Hey everybody, Tom Joya from Visionary Music Group here. Hope you're doing great. Continuing with our top 20 mix series, mix tip 12. Making a mix template. After all these tips we've been through, you're probably thinking, this is gonna take me forever to set this up every time I do a session. All these aux sends and returns, parallel sends and returns. Oh, there's stuff on my mix bus. I don't even want to mix. So you make a template and you save it on a day that you're not mixing. So when the day comes to mix, you pop open your mix template and you import your tracks in or vice versa, depending upon what the session needs. For instance, in my mix template, I have everything set up. I have my two bus processing. I have all my side chain effects, my grouping to compressor sends. I have all my sends and returns of all my effects for everything, reverbs, delays, for vocals, for instruments. And then I have all the auxes for groups and the VCAs, as we discussed earlier. So I'm ready to go. And then the only thing that has to happen is I have to import my audio and route outputs to that. So that's super important uh, because you can spend much, much more time mixing. Make a mix template when you're not mixing and it'll save you time when you are. The empty picture free Hang low Silence in all its weight Won't let me go